Hi, there are three ways of looking at the delta in GoCharting platform. So the first and easiest way is I go here in the top menu under indicators and, and under order flow, I will go and add bar statistics. When I add bar statistics, a lot of statistics will come here as you can see. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to select only the ones that I need. So let me remove trades, buy, sell, and go directly to buy volume, sell volume. So there are metrics in here, and in the bottom you will see here delta, max delta, minimum delta, and cumulative delta. So I will add all those delta metrics here and get rid of the other ones, which I don't need. POC. All right, so this is a uh, first way of doing it. So now, as you can see here, I have uh, max delta, min del delta, POC, max delta, min delta, cumulative delta in here. So this is your first way, okay? Now let me go ahead and delete this indicator. Okay, and the next way is, again, under indicators, under order flow, I have something called delta bars. Delta bars give you basically the delta in the form of candlestick. Now in this you can either have delta bars or you can also have something called as cumulative delta which accumulates the delta over the current day. So this is your, as you can see, uh, this is your cumulative delta. Okay. So this is your second way. And the third way is in the chart I will add cluster chart, okay, which I have here. Okay, now in the cluster chart, if I expand, I zoom in, you will see on the left hand side by default you have the sell, and for right, in right hand side you have the buy. Now I want delta, so what I'm going to do is, if you want to see delta on a candle level, that means for the full candle, you go to the settings of this chart, and there I will choose delta marker. Okay. So I will choose delta marker and you will see on the top of every candle the delta is written. In red means negative delta, in green means positive delta. Okay, That's the candle level delta. But if you want to see the delta within each candle, then <coughs> here you, know, you have two columns. The left hand column which is the sell and the right hand column which is the buy. Okay, Now you have the ability to change it. So you can choose any metric you want on the left hand side and any metric you want on the right hand side. So in the left hand side, say I'm making total volume. Okay. So the left hand side is now total volume. And on the right hand side here, and I will choose Delta. Okay. Now let me make it show profile so that show profile. I think I'll just keep it a single column. Let me make this single column and here I will choose delta. Okay. And without a profile. Okay. So now you are seeing the delta within each of the candles. Okay. And um, and the total delta for the entire candle on the top. All right. Thank you so much.